I'm trying a new window bird feeder. It's called Wild Birds of Joy. Oh, this is Matthew 626. Birds love it. Window bird feeder. It says extra large. Okay. Well, this is how big it is. I put my hand back here. So it's pretty big. So you have a viewing because these little holes here, these suction cups have little things here that fit in there and the suction cups are on your window. And then here's your little viewing hole. And then here's your feeder and it's a tray. So I like that about this one because, yep, there goes the phone. Because you can take this tray out every night because we take our feeders in, keep rats away. So you can take it out, bring it in the house, and then you have two sections so you can feed two different bird seeds and then a divider for that. Of course, there's a divider for that, I meant to say. And then there's also these little drain holes in case water gets in there, the rain gets in there. So I have much higher hopes for this one than the one with the camera. And I guess I could probably stick my camera right there if I'm watching birds. However, I think it would scare them off. Just walking out here scared the uh, doves off of these two feeders here. Although doves feel safer on the ground than on a feeder anyway, so that's part of it, I'm sure. But anyway, so um, when I get it assembled and on the window, I will ch check back and tell you, show you how it went as far as getting it on and if it's staying up there and how the birds feel about it. And I have another one of these coming, so maybe I'll be able to do both feeders in one video. All right, I will see you later. So here's my new bird feeder from the inside, the window. And this is what I see. And notice there's a big hole. I think I showed you that before. For really good viewing there. I have seen a bird land on it twice. Both times it was a tufted titmouse. I don't know if any other birds have landed on it. The tufted titmice or mouse are pretty friendly. So let's go see it outside. So here we are outside. And hello, can you see me? <laughs> and uh, so every night, instead of taking in the whole bird feeder, we just pull out the tray and put it in. We have to take our bird feeders in because of rats. It's Florida and we get these fruit rats. Oh, peanut jumped. So I have the mixed nuts over here. Mostly it's peanuts and hulled sunflower, but there's pistachios and pecans in there as well. And then these are black oil and striped sunflowers and saf, um, saf, saf flower seeds that are uh, out of the hull. If they come in a hull, I don't even know what a saf flower <laughs> looks like. So <clears throat> that's it hanging up. Yeah, it's a, uh, we don't really have a lip over the window but we do have one at the roof line a little bit. So it didn't seem to get real wet, although it does have all those holes at the bottom. The seed feels good. I might've put too much in for a new bird feeder. And I don't know how many birds are going to actually be brave enough to eat here. The tufted titmouse are pretty friendly. They're the only ones that'll eat off the feeders in the back when we're on the screen porch. So they were not shy about coming to this feeder, but uh, I think like blue jays and such probably won't. But so that's it. So far, I'm going to give this thing a thumbs up. I like it. I like to be able to see them. Um, <clears throat> I'm anxious for more birds to try it out. I think maybe when the cardinals come, they will try it out. Jerry hung my bird feeders today, so they're all in the wrong places. <laughs> that's all right. <laughs> Yeah, he's got it all mixed up here. <laughs> so, yeah, every night we take in the, well, it was four bird feeders up here. Now we have the new new one. Uh, definitely like that bird feeder. And hopefully I can somehow figure out a way to get some good photography of a bird eating there, some close up. Put some kind of motion sensor camera on it, like I tried to do with the other bird feeder that this one replaced. 